guys. So we're at a picnic. At a picnic or we're having a picnic. Have... <laughs> yeah, we just came to somebody's picnic. We're having a picnic and we're having a interesting conversation. I'm like not even looking at okay. Having an interesting conversation, so yeah, just join. So speaking of medium rare. Medium rare. What about? Well, actually, what are? What's there, there's three types of ways you cook meat, right? There's well done, medium rare, and, and extra virgin oil. <laughs> <laughs> what was the other one? Um, well done. I what? said well done. Oh. Okay, wait. Okay. Well, rare, medium rare. Done rare. Medium rare. <laughs> medium rare. rare. No. I said, said that. Oh medium my God. well. Medium well? You didn't say that. I guess that's, that's what like it is. the most common one. Medium well. That's like in between. You have medium rare, me or medium well is like in the middle, still juicy. Some people just well done. want the whole pig. Uh that's what I was gonna tell you. This girl at my work was talking about her sister and she said that this girl seriously wants a steak that's bloody. Like, it has to be bloody. It's warm, but it's bloody. She doesn't like it any other way. It's red and it's warm. And I said, can you get sick from that? And she was like, no, steaks are different. And that's the thing, steaks and fish, you can eat them however you want. But really? chicken, So what's the difference be between beef and fish? And uh, chicken, well, what are the two different... Chicken can get, like, you can get salmonella from chicken. But for some reason, with fish and beef products, I mean, they... I mean, I guess that would kind of make sense. Best. It would explain why people feed raw beef to their animals. Yeah. But they don't feed raw chicken. To yeah, them. you can't... Yeah, because, like... I know, I was just thinking about that, and I was like, that's true, because some people, they go out in the wilderness, and they eat a fish just like that out, you know, and then they're sushi for all fish, so, and then she even told me, well, the best way to cook a steak is leave it at room temperature for just a little bit, and then put it on the grill. Which is what people, I've never seen anybody just take a steak right after freezing, just drop it on the grill. All right, Billy, we're about to cook it right <laughs> off like that, now. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> what was I say? Uh, she said that there's, uh, we were talking about steaks or something like that, and she said her son-in-law or something like that used to work at, I think, one of the steak houses, mm -hmm. and there would be this same old lady that would come in there, like, every few weeks, and she would want a cold steak straight out the, out the refrigerator, bloody, not cooked, nothing. She said, I can understand a steak with blood that's warm, but a cold steak, you ain't even going to heat it up. I advise you, don't put it all in your mouth at the same time. Just get it back. Yeah, I know. You got to give it a chance. Yeah, okay. So you'll like it? It's all right. Don't lie to me. I mean, it's good, but... I don't know, man. Chocolate's really not my thing. Anymore. Yeah. You can tell it's mine. Yeah. <laughs> when you watch this video, how many times I'm sleeping up on you? What? You're trying awesome. to burn yeah. me. Yeah. Poor baby. <laughs> Film yourself, son. I'm like. Film me. How about that? Okay. Catch me outside. How about that? Catch me outside. How about that? The holes are laughing. <laughs> are the... Yeah, I just started laughing. I'm not up, y'all. Okay. <laughs> mm. Jesus. Um. The holes are laughing. That first yep. white was not. The, the that holes good. are laughing. Yep. Um. So. They go bay in the background. Hey. Hey. Um. Not talking to you. It won't focus. There you go. Hey, Daddy. 
How you doing? Back to this sexy thing. How you doing? Are you talking to the tree? I mean, I can. But I was really talking to you. Oh, hey there. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm lovely. I'm tired. We were just talking about earlier, you guys, how for some reason, when you eat outside, it's like everything tastes so much better. Like, Somebody put in the comments why that is. I said because maybe like usually when you eat, you're like it's dark and or you're watching TV. So you got one cent, one cent. I don't know how to say that. You got you got one of your senses, <coughs> like <coughs> like occupied by something else. When you're out here, it's like it's so bright and everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you're a pretty young lady. Huh? I said you're pretty. You're pretty. So when are you and your boyfriend gonna break up? Never. <laughs> you call. Catch me outside. I'm gonna let you know. Catch him outside. But I'm trying to get down. Then get down. Ain't nobody stopping you. <laughs> it's just the ground. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Can I have your number then? Nope. <laughs> <Why not? laughs> Let's see. Let's see. What's my number? 901. 1-800-BACKUP. 1-800-BACKUP. All right, let me write that down. 1-800-BACKUP. You don't want this. <laughs> but I do, that's why I'm talking to you. No, you don't. You don't. Nah. It's all right. I mean, even if you do, I don't want that, so. Why not? You being stingy with the butt? Okay. Hmm? It's my butt. <laughs> <laughs> it's my butt. <laughs> that's my boyfriend. So, I mean. Your boyfriend don't own you, girl. You're your own woman. Claimed. You're your own woman. Your boyfriend doesn't own you. Why are you still talking to me? <laughs> I'm just trying to get down. Let me get, get your down, number. Get down, then. What do you need? A step stool? No. <laughs> no. He wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. <laughs> <laughs> You need a ladder? Because you're not going to be climbing this one. Mm -hmm. So are you telling me that you're going to give me your number? No, that's actually the exact opposite of what I'm telling you. So you're saying that we can't go out? I'm saying that... No. <laughs> <laughs> totally. Alright, I'll stop trying. All right, good. Your boyfriend ain't got nothing on me, though. Your boyfriend ain't got no mixtape coming out next week. Your mixtape is not even support me on that bill. On a level that's even close to Damien Wharton. Okay. Who that? Don't worry about it. Just know you ain't him, and you ain't every on me. Mmm. 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 Oh, hmm. When are you gonna let me have your number? You already have my number. That's why I'm here. So I pretend I'm a girl. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, pretend you're a girl. All right. So I gotta pretend so, you're somebody that's not uh you, like some other girl. So Damien, I noticed that you were having trouble in math. Would you like to study with me sometime? I didn't know you could study math. I've never studied math. I can show you how. I mean, true. Okay. <laughs> okay, well, uh, when can I come to your house? Um, there's only one girl allowed in my house, to be real. I'm not even kidding. I'm, I'm talking to you on this one right now. There's only one girl that's allowed to my house, and that's you. <laughs> <laughs> Better be. You're my girlfriend, so you got privilege, but 
Like, not even my friends can come to my house. That's how much my parents like you, so you should be proud of yourself. All right. All right. music. 